happy vlog member where we at day number 20 i slept in of course i'm sitting in the living room today is the day i'm gonna start decorating for christmas i'm so excited uh, but i'm also tired so that's why i'm just been chilling and looking on tiktok but i pulled my decor out some of them doing it slow Ava's sleeping good too. She'll be in my parents' house later this evening because she's on winter break. I will get her back on Wednesday evening. Um, I'm off Thursday Thanksgiving. I also um, took Friday off. So then I'll have like a four day weekend and super excited. I'm telling you Christmas, it's gonna fly by. But yeah, you guys, my cousin, my little cousin said I was stupid. He's 11 years old. He played something that was inappropriate and it sounded like, like literally coochie. That's what I heard. And I said, stop playing that. There's a bad word in it. He was like talking back to me. And then he said something else. Like maybe it was worded differently, but I swore it sounded like coochie. My bad. And he called me, you're stupid. I'm like, what'd you say? Did you just call me stupid? Say, yeah. So I say stuff back to him. And then he got all quiet. So then he was pretty pissed off after that. And I texted his dad. I'm not sure if he's going to say anything to him. His parents are a little special too. Um, but he's always been like not a very proper kid. Very awkward. Um, doesn't know how to interact in social settings like most kids like Ava and I'm trying to give him the benefit of the doubt because it's how he was raised and I really pray and hope that he comes out of this funk and wants to do things as he gets older and throughout his whole childhood I have tried especially when Ava was born I you know I always include him during the holidays and stuff like again if it wasn't for me this kid would have never experienced Christmas you know, Halloween, Easter, all the fun kitty stuff that, you know, most kids should experience. Um, especially, you know, him being born here in the States and not in Cambodia, you know. But I think at this point, it's what he's used to and how he was brought up. I cannot change it at the moment. But I think, I don't know. I don't, I have no words right now. But yeah, I texted his dad, and then like maybe a few minutes later, I heard some like texting um, sounds on his phone, but not sure. But then like he called my stepdad, which is his brother. Um, yeah, so I don't know. But anyway, I did say that you're welcome to come over for Thanksgiving. We're having you know a little get together, and then when they went home with my parents, he texted, "I'm not going," and I say, "Is it because you don't want to?" He said, yeah. And then, like, I, I say, well, thank you for Ava's gift. Um, and he just goes, uh-huh. And then later we sent a picture of Ava working on the, uh, what's it called? Gingerbread house. He goes, okay. Like, this kid does not have any, any excitement. It just makes me so sad. But it's how he grew up. But I, I really try with this kid. He's just, he a little different. But yeah, I did my part. And I think I'm done. Um, so yeah. I don't know why I feel bad decorating this stuff without Ava. But this stuff she doesn't really know how to do. Um, I'm still deciding if um, we'll get her her personal Christmas tree. But she wants a rainbow. And that's just, yeah, that's going to room. But we'll see. Anyway, I'm just going to chill. It's like I'm excited to decorate, but I feel overwhelmed. I just need to do another load of laundry later today and pick up the mess that the kids did. Yeah, it was perfectly cleaned. But let me show you. Of course, the clothes comes off. And Ava made this cute little, like, boxed bed thingy. She is so creative. Here, let me show you. She surprised me sometimes. It's supposed to be a bed, but here's just sitting and cutting things. This is a Target box, and look, she cut some pieces and turned two legs and stuff. This is adorable. Like, I was in shock. Like, kids are smart, y'all. 
they just make things. How adorable is this? It's so cute when I ask her. She's like, how do you know how to do this, Ava? My brain, mom. My brain. So cute. The mess from yesterday. Hey, guys. I'm still bugging it. It's like 1 o'clock already. Slowly decorating. Just um, start with the dining table. I got my decor out. And I'm just taking my time. Going back and forth. You guys, decorating is exhausting. Am I crazy? Oh, yeah, but if I imagine having a big house to decorate or having like a big ass tree more than um, six feet. But yeah, my tape's looking really cute. I don't want to show you guys yet, but my vision is coming to life. And then I like more visions coming to play as I go along putting stuff and see what I need and where to put things but I'm so excited um and I'm also cleaning and wiping my fall decor and it's going to a specific spot for next year I'm so proud of myself I'm so happy about all the things that I got you know they were expensive but not too expensive but it's like I feel like it's good quality it's not like Dollar Tree stuff. Not to say that Dollar Tree doesn't have some good stuff, but I told you guys, I want to invest in nice things for years to come so I can reuse them and then from time to time, maybe I'll buy new stuff, but I think I did a pretty good job. But I have this obsession, like, my inner child is so, like, yeah. but yeah, Ava woke up like an hour and a half ago, mom called and lazy bum about to have a couple of those just heating the water right now and mom called me and asked when we're going to the wild lights at the zoo i'm like who is she and where's my mom she never asked to go and she never wants to go especially when it's cold but she's asking like what happened did she like ask me to see my video because my step be watching it hmm. Hmm. yeah wiping and dusting the um pumpkins. So we finally ate last night's dinner from Olive Garden from the other day. But this is the cake. Which one was it? Like triple fudge something? I don't know. And I want to try it. Let it thaw a little bit because it was in the fridge. It looks so good. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Just took a bite and it's very rich. Oh my gosh. A triple layer. I don't know what was what, but I see fudge, the white stuff, I don't know, me, and chocolate. Look at the layers. Mmm, very you're thick. Right where you are. Don't try to oh my god. Y'all, you know me scrolling TikTok. I just found out the Green Ranger, like the original Power Rangers. He, uh, unaligned himself. Like, oh my god. Like, that's like my childhood. Like, we are not okay, you guys. I just cannot imagine what people must feel to get to that point. Like, I know I'm depressed a lot many, many, many times. Like, I feel like my life is just over. But I just cannot get myself to... And then life myself. It just, I don't know what to say. Like, it just make you think. You just never, never, never know what anybody is going through. It's so hard. I feel like every day, every week, every month, you hear something. Especially around the holidays, it's hard for any family to have to deal with a death in a family. It's crazy. You guys, hang, in, hang on. Hang on, please. I'm still working on decor slowly, but I just started putting stuff on my um, TV stand. And it's like, I'm just admiring my little Christmas village. So I have it on the TV stand and I have it on my shoe cabinet as well. And then once everything's put on, I'm going to decide if I need anything else. 
Oh my god, it's so cute. I feel like a little kid is staring at a candy shop. Like, who knew something like this would make me so happy and like giddy? Is that the word inside? Like, my heart is like, I can't, I can't, it's jumping for joy. Like, from like, like this to like, uh, like, I cannot explain. Like, I'm not. I like the decor of Christmas, but I'm not religious about Christmas, if that makes any sense. Even Thanksgiving, it's, you know, it's a decor, it's, you know, the family getting together, it's that season, and I, don't, I can't explain it. It's just not the religious part of it, but even I say I'm not religious, God is good, God is good, because <laughs> I'm here, I'm alive, I'm healthy, I have my daughter we're not perfect but we are here being able to wake up and being able to go out and do things freely um even if i don't have much i'm able to because again people are struggling out there whether it's mentally financially and there's people out there with no homes homeless but yeah, I've always won a Christmas village. I just can't believe. One day I shall own, own a house and call it mine. Uh, why can't he make buying a home easy as buying a car? Ava's hanging fun with makeup. We did one round right now. She's doing like a Halloween makeup on me. Did I say go to Halloween party? At mom's house, but eat some porridge. Fun. Rice of full, rice of with taste good. No, you don't have any to eat. You want me to? You want me to? You want me to? You at mom's house. Today's the perfect day for this. I shall try to make this one day. Haven't done it myself, but I lied. I made it once years ago. But I shall try again. One is day. Yum. Mm. Hey friends, just got home. It's freaking cold. I thought I'd be here on, but I guess not. But yeah, just dropped Ava off and then had dinner at my mom's house um yeah I'm gonna chill relax edit some videos of course for today's vlog and then the American Music Awards is on today in a few more minutes it's about to be eight soon I used to always watch every single award awards MTV the American Music Awards the Grammys but in like the last few years as I got older, like, I don't care for it anymore. It just got more boring. Like, I don't know if maybe because we were younger, we were teens. We were just so excited about watching stars on TV. I don't know. But I, I always miss it now for for a long time, I can say. But I'm going to relax my couch. So I got my giant wreath on. My Christmas village is placed. Oh, I cannot wait to show you guys. I just don't want to show yet. But I can't wait. When everything's complete, it's starting and pink. I love pink. 